All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Our next contest for three rounds of fighting at 51 kilograms. Please welcome your first fighter to the blue corner, Nadia Barela. Welcome her opponent to the red corner, Katie LaFan. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Three rounds of fighting at 51 kilograms. This is the second bout in our Super Fight Series, Mighty Fist Taekwondo versus Kickboxing Tournament. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, representing KO Team Portugal, here is Nadia Barreles. And her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Representing Ireland, here is Katie LaFan. And once again, when the action begins, your referee in charge is Paul Nichols. So our second kickboxing versus taekwondo bout is another international. Nadia Barella's KO team Portugal for the kickboxing squad. Katie Laffan from Ireland for the taekwondo team. And the first bout was drawn, so still an even playing field for both these ladies. Three three-minute rounds. Barellas versus Laffin. Barellas and Boo from Portugal. Laffin in the red from Ireland. And immediately that trademark taekwondo sidekick. Pushed out like a jab. Leg longer than the arm. Novice kickboxers, I find, always have a problem getting beyond that left leg one, especially when they push it out like a machine gun like that, that lead leg with the side kick. The answer is not to come in in a straight line because you will get caught like that. Taken from the mats to the ring, side kick pushed out, often as a machine gun, but she chipped her right hand there, then the left leg from Borellas, who gritted her teeth, came in strongly. And both girls trading heavy kicks, but Barella's getting the better of it when it comes to the punches over the top as well. Laughing light on her feet, variety of kicks as you'd expect. Barella's looking to walk her down. More roundhouse kicking than that side kick. A spin kick out of range, and when you do that, Barella's has got to punish her. But a step in when she's off balance, just like now, and work the hands over the top. Getting inside, laughing, knee as well, good knee to the midsection of the Irish fighter. Borella's closing the face, there's that side kick again, just like a jab it's used. But once you get inside it, you must work. Spin kick, 360, doesn't quite land the side kick. Laughing, digging deep as Borella's comes forward. Borella's chasing, you've got to cut the ring down, not chase from side around the ring. You mustn't follow her. Gives her time to set up that kick. Cut it down like that and then come straight in, get those knees going. And then the hands over the top. Good work right at the end of the round from Borellas. Very even opening round there. Obviously Laffin, you could see, very good at distance with that side kick. Pushed out like a jab, working behind it to get a girl off balance. But every time she got inside, I was impressed with Borellas' work on the inside. Still everything to, to fight for here, though, across two more rounds. So as you can see, Borellas better on the inside, the knee there, the left hand lands, and that knee to the midsection, you saw laugh and grimace, and that's where she will have the success. Superb work at the end of the round from the Portuguese fighter. That's what happens if you can get inside that potent sidekick. Laffin really had to suck it up there in the last 10 seconds, and that will give Borellas something to work on here in the second. So two or three, 
and Laffin will look to keep it at range again. Borella, she knows where she needs to be, inside that side kick, landing the knees. Getting inside the problem, though, and you can hear the taekwondo crowd roar as that side kick lands again. So they go away once more. Borella's patient. Low chopping kick, but she can't be at that side kick range. She must get inside it, that's when she had success. That's what Laffin does, uses it like a jab, then the hands over the top. Good start from the Irish girl. Punching that side kick out, and then working her hands over the top when her opponent's off balance. This is where Borellis needs to be, inside. A solid left hand, and then the kick to the midsection, walking her down now. Very strong Borellis, you get the feeling. And when she's inside, that right hand and then that knee. Oh, double knee. And Laffin really felt that and got the count here. Borellis, when she walks beyond that side kick, gets inside it. That big right hand and then those big, big knees cause all sorts of problems. It is the textbook kickboxing versus taekwondo bout. If you were to say to people, this is what it's about, that side kick that's like a piston from Laffin, pushing it out like a jab, accurate, high, midsection, and then once she's on the inside, the punches and knees of Borellas. That's the styles epitomised, and it's showing perfectly in this bout. Borellas weathering those side kicks. There's the timing from Laffin. But Borellis weathering those, and when she gets inside, the vicious punching and the knees. But it's getting inside and staying there. That's where she needs to be. The round kick in reply to Laffin's. Oh, the, the hook kick from Laffin, but Borellis walks through it again and looks to bring the knee in at the end of the round. Good work there from Laffin, but the big count in favour of Borellis. So there's that side kick from Laffin, it's like a jab, it pops out, it's accurate, take her off balance, superbly timed. But once she gets inside, this is what Borellis is capable of. Look, watch this knee coming in. That really hurt Laffin, she brings it in again, but releases from the clincher, it was just a straight knee. She wasn't actually holding there, and you could see Laffin grimace. And that's what I said about the perfect contrast of styles. When it's at range, Laffin is accurate and hurtful with that side kick, scoring points taking Borellis off balance when she gets inside that leg the knees of Borellis and those short shopping roundhouses go to work excellent matchup and away they go for the third and final round and you know what Laffin's going to do Borellis will want to get inside that and work a hard game performance from Laffin but you feel the Portuguese is so strong now the crowd loved that hook kick but it's got to land if that had landed there that's better from Laffin that's what you expect to see from a Taekwondo expect, exponent with those kicks. And the second one did land. That's the danger, that's the strength. Good start to the third round from Laffin. But this is where Borellis needs to capitalise once she gets inside that leg. And there's the chopping left hand. Laffin felt that, grits her teeth, blinks her eyes. Borellis didn't realise she'd hurt her girl. But now there's the strength of Borellis. The knees and the hand. And again, the moment Borellis gets in there, Laffin has to take the count. It's a great performance from the Taekwondo girl, but it's the conditioning and the strength of the kickboxer Borellis that is the equaliser here, walking through that side kick to get to where she needs to be to hurt her opponent and get those counts that are the difference in this bout. Laughing, showing you everything that's good about Taekwondo, her movement, her kicking ability, her hands are good as well, but Borellis, when she gets inside, punishes her with hard and heavy work. And again, the knee is instinctive. With Borellis, the knee comes up instinctively to do the damage. The difference between the two women is the powerful knees of Borellis and that left hand, which gets... There you go! Laffin's got no answer to that left hand, left knee combination. That knee is devastating. And Laffin is beginning to feel it now. It's been a gutsy performance, superb kicking. But on the inside, Borellis has been vicious and hurtful and so, so strong. And Laffin, what a performance. She's really won the hearts of the crowd here tonight. But look how Borellas just walks through it. And then when she gets inside, those left and rights, she is just so strong. Big win, I feel, for the Portuguese fighter. But a great performance from both girls, perfectly displaying the qualities of both arts.
perfect matchup to say this is what we mean. And as you can see, Laffin's kicking superb. Hook kicks, she's good with her fists as well, but once on the inside, the power, the roundhouse there, then the knee, look at that. Laffin's already crumbling, she lets go to land the second knee, so it's legal. Left and right, another knee goes bashing in. Borella so strong, and those knees, and oh, there's the roundhouse, bang. That was the difference between the two girls, when Borella's got there, she was ruthless. And so, so powerful. Chops across. The clinch, the right hand, the left hand, right at the bell, brilliant stuff. All right, ladies and gentlemen, for three rounds of fighting, once again, we go to the judges' scorecards. Our judges score this round 30-25, 30-24, and 30-24. For your winner by unanimous decision, fighting out of the blue corner, Nadia 